Helona, Helona, everybody. As we all saw, by the way, with the upcoming test patch, if you haven't, make sure to go watch my video on it because there's some pretty crazy shit happening. But as we all saw, of course, uh, the um, the next patch is going to be removing Tiger. We have to get level three Tiger. That's going to be one of my one of my first. Let's be the salty carrots. That's going to be one of my utmost priorities and at all of these videos until that patch comes out. I want to get level three Tiger. What if it's like a legacy? What if it's like a legacy achievement that you can no longer get after that, you know? Ooh, a little bit of lag there. We draw? No, we win, actually. We win because we have the strongest duck in the universe. Duck is also getting nerfed. Pretty much, go watch that video. There's a lot of stuff that that's going to get changed that... I think is uh I think is good to know actually. I think it's really good to know this information and ahead of time. So uh yeah, we're here. We are the salty carrots and we're gonna try. There's a few things I wanna try. I've been I wanna get level three tiger before the tiger gets removed. And uh also I uh I wanna try I watched a little bit of Germa playing Super Auto Pets. Hilarious by the way. It was a great time, great video, I loved it. But he did some crazy tiger level three hedgehog strategy that honestly, I want a little piece of that cake. So I'm going to be looking to, to try and make that work. That's like the worst outcome there with the otter, but it's fine. I mean, we could, I guess we could freeze that. And sure, let's, let's send it. Let's use these units before they get changed, before they get changed. Because look, we can use the rat. And try and get something something fun happening there. You know what? Let's do let's do melon armor. Let's do melon armor ar melon armor rat. Let's do it like this. But yeah, I, I'm I'm excited and terrified for the new patch. I, once again, I put out a video on it where I I talk for like 50 minutes about all the different changes. So make sure you go watch that. But pretty much, I'm not super thrilled about the changes because it feels like uh oh they might win because of the badger here. I'm a, I'm a big fan of when games... Oh! Oh my god, the dirty rat did something. I'm a big fan of when games, instead of nerfing really strong things, they buff weaker things. And that's kind of the opposite of what they're doing here. They're just buffing everything that's strong. Uh, they're just nerfing everything that's strong. Did I say that correctly? I don't know what I'm saying. I'm barely paying attention as is. But we are... We're, we're going to continue doing our thing here. I don't mind running another duck if it comes down to it. I do want to run the hedgehog strat, though. I'm pretty excited to run the hedgehog strat. I think this looks good for now. We can just go ahead and uh, hit this and send it. That, that seems to be the best strategy for now. We, you know, it's all about winning the current round. The vague towers. How the? What are you doing over there? I see you. I see you with your like level three ant. What are you doing, huh? You think this is a joke? You think I'm fucking around right now? Watch this. We probably we probably lose to this badger, by the way. Actually, we draw because of the hedgehog. I'm telling you, dude, the hedgehog the hedgehog is goaded. It's probably one of the more fun units in the game, though. To be fair, being realistic about it. You know, we 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 do what we do here. Send it like this. Hang on, before we do that, buy the rabbit. So we got one extra HP there. And then, you roll once, you get another hedgehog, you gotta keep it for sure. Wait, I just realized, no, why did I put garlic on this? It gets replaced by the melon armor anyway. We're gonna have to run it like this now. I think. <laughs> or something, I mean, I don't want the melon armor to go to waste. Fine, we could do it like this, it'll be fine, right? It won't be a problem. Two ducks. Okay, send it. Let's go. I keep saying send it. I, I gotta get off the send it train. It's, it's I don't look as as funny as a little juice, a little squeeze, and all that is. I don't want to be known for saying two different things. I kind of think that's why. Um, that was that that meta, the little juice, little squeeze was was phased out. You know, if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. Okay. Don't worry about it if you don't. Holy shit. The strongest kangaroo. We definitely lose. I'm. It's been an uprise. There's been an uprise in badgers, dude. Everyone's running badger now. And honestly, I welcome it. I think that's pretty fun. 
Dodo is also getting nerfed soon, so we gotta make we gotta we gotta strike while the while the iron's hot. But I want I don't want to run it this time. I don't want to run it this time because I'm 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 looking to. We're just gonna do it. We're just gonna get rid of it. We're gonna have to do it at some point, right? So. I'm looking f I'm looking towards greener pastures. You know. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. We lose this round, by the way. And this is a completely a non-functional round. Or an unfunctional team that we've got here, but look, look, what is this dog? What is this gonna do? Up in front. We we definitely lose. They got they got kangaroo. But that's okay. Look, we got we got we got hedgehog. We're gonna make it work. I need to, to get to a point where I can make it work. I don't even know how we got to that point, I'll be honest, because I skipped to the end of the stream. By the way, don't ever do that with anyone's content, okay? So watch the whole thing is good. Ooh, dude, we could we could totally we could totally afford to run a uh, a snail heel, but first, do that. Shark is totally we could to oh well no because we got hedgehog at the back so I guess we can't. Okay, send it. It's been sent. Um, enjoy. And then, as weird as it is. I feel like we should get any I feel like Melon Armor is just not good on Peacock, honestly. We are so we are so dead. Just because I'm trying to, to make this weird shit work. Let's see, let's see. This this is a trial run, okay? I will make the hedgehog the hedgehog work. Look, these people are taking advantage of the one of the, the, the rooster's last days on this earth before it, Teamwood Games just autumn just just I almost said automatically, just completely like crucifies the oh man by one attack. By the way, just completely nerfs it to the ground. But honestly, it's probably deserved, right? Dude, okay, we 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 have to get rid of this. I don't know what I'm doing, but this this can work right now. And uh, yeah, we can we can afford to do that. This is just a non-functional squad, is what we're looking at right here. But we're 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 we're, we're, we're gonna try. We're gonna try. So don't put Melon on the peacock because getting hurt is actually kind of its thing. Who would have thought that an animal with a function that is literally that that gets buff when it when it gets hurt would rely on getting hurt? You could have fooled me. Do we? No, we lose by one again to a swan. That's why it's getting nerfed by 1 HP. I actually contacted Team Wood Games myself personally, and I was like, I keep losing to swans by 1 HP. So I'm going to need you to nerf them. Okay. Um, the We're going to be the the creamy streamers. That's what I was known as before I changed my name to Kona. I was just the creamy streamer. I would tell you, but uh, I would tell you why, rather, but... Um, it's against TOS. Just let it be known. I was the creamiest. And then you send this. Do it like that. Yeah, that's what you like to see. Hmm. 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 Minecraft villager noises. You can afford to run a cricket. Like, I guess it doesn't matter right now. B is nice. I've been studying the tiers, by the way. I'm, get I'm getting more into this game than I thought I ever would. I was looking into the... Holy shit, what is this? I was looking into the... the. We probably win this, by the way. Wait, no. No, we, we lose. Wait, no, we draw, we draw, we draw. That's because you're running Bluebird. I still need to get the, the, the expansion pack. Alright. This is it. We're going to roll once. We're going to roll one more time. We this can get us a ton of wins by the way. This uh so let's just let's just go all in on it actually. You might think that's a strange way of doing it and you're probably right. But we have a 56 kangaroo. We got to use the we got to use the these things while we have them once again. The swan, that's why we got a 3-3 swan. And the ducks, you're not going to be able to do this soon. Overall, I kind of wish that there was more of a focus. By the way, we completely take out this uh, this dog here. 
I wish there was more of a focus on buffing the weaker units because I think a lot of animals in this game could use it. Get out of here. Golden poop. I'm wearing my Santa hat. I do think a lot, a lot of units in this game could do with the... Uh... We can do it like this for now. Could do with the with, with more buffs instead of nerfing everything around the the units, but you know it's a thing where I'm not a game designer. I don't know what I'm talking about. I, I could sit here and tell you all about how I think this should be stronger and this should be changed, but overall I don't I don't really know. I I I've never designed a game, so I don't know if it's really that. Obviously, it's not easy, but I don't know if it's a good idea. I, I brought a oh that's horrible cricket or uh, ant luck by the way. But I had brought up an idea during my uh, my patch notes video, which was, for example, changing every unit's max to 100-100 and then effectively doubling every unit's current... Uh... Hmm. Interesting, but I'm going to have to pass. Effectively doubling every unit's current stats. And what that would enable you to do is enable like half steps for example so i mean i talked about it during the 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 video but if a giraffe is a one three then you could turn it into a two six instead and if the max is 100 100 and you double every unit stats it should be around the same right and that would allow a half step between so instead of making so a horse right now is a one one right so you could turn it into a two two instead if the max is 100 100 and what that ends up doing, I mean, look, giraffe is bad, but like. That's not where I wanted that, but it's fine. We'll, we'll freeze the giraffe. But yeah, that would allow you to add a a middle step between the, the buffs so it wouldn't have to be as drastic. So you don't have to go from like, because right now the difference between one, one HP is a pretty big deal. The, the, the swan getting nerfed from a 3-4 to a 3-3 three, three is pretty massive. Like it changes so many so many matchups and it changes the, the, the reason why the unit is so good in the first place. But that's such a big change that I'm like, is that really a good change for the game itself? I don't know. I couldn't I couldn't tell you, dude. Really couldn't tell you. Anyway, we're gonna try running hedgehog again. <laughs> I I meant to unfreeze you, apologies. We're gonna roll pretty hard here. There it is. One more? Come on, give us one more. Um, what If we don't get what we want, I guess we could freeze this just in case. And then roll. Okay, so we didn't get what we wanted, so we can do it like this. Just because, you know. Ideally, you'd run it like this. It's, not, it's a little strange, but then this thing would get to attack three times instead of twice. Which would buff the the kangaroo more. If the, the more the cricket attacks, the stronger the kangaroo gets, right? So that's a seven seven turtle at the front. I sense. Actually, no, they're running snail. Dude, what the hell does the lobster do? I've seen the lobster around like once or twice, and I still don't understand what it does. We survive that. We absolutely destroy everything else here. I'm feeling pretty good, and we're we're not running dog. We're just I mean we're running swan, we're running kangaroo, but like come on man, I can only do so much, you know. Very well. Hmm. We're kind of relying on this cricket right now. I would like to pivot off that as soon as possible. Maybe switching, maybe putting a swan in front would be better. We could we could afford to sell it. Let's just go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's pivot off the cricket. We don't want to run quick cricket for too long. Can. I'm actually going to invest in some cans here because we're pretty slow. We're pretty slow with our scaling right now. Dude, I want to get to level three. I want to get to level three. Uh, Level three snail. Okay. Well, look. I think what we do here is we instead <clears throat> give the snail a bone attack. Once again, it's a little strange. I was going to give the, the bone attack to the turtle, and maybe that would have been the play to hit something up front really hard. But we're going to... Oh, I didn't freeze the pill! Well, that's okay. 
Okay, okay. I see you. I see you and your 9-9 your nine -nine rooster. Very impressive. Unfortunately, that hits our swan pretty hard. And we're not able to take it out. It's going to do quite a number on our team here. And we lose, right? Yeah, we definitely lose. We're, there's no way we're going to be able to take out this butterfly. Fair play to you. A lot of people running expansion pack one, huh? A surprising amount of people running it. Hmm. Who made the video, huh? Who made the video? There's a tuber somewhere that made a video. Now everyone knows. Oh, dude, wait. We could totally make this work. Freeze this temporarily. Hit that. I'm going to... Oh, uh, yeah, I'm going to roll. Yeah, there we go. It's not like we're going to afford to replace the, the unit anyway. I was trying to get a replacement for the... A replacement that could that could get buffed now. For the... um <clears throat> For the turtle there, but it didn't really work out in the end, so... Whatever, we're doing it like this. That gets plus, plus four, plus two, then we get a cow. Overall, this is just looking great. This is looking great. Freeze that as well. Here's our next turn. That, that, and then this. And hopefully we survive this this turn. There still can't be... Next turn is when, when scorpions are unlocked. But someone could have early scorpion. So you got to be a little careful. This person's running a level 2B, 10-9B with garlic armor. I respect the hell out of you, my friend. But unfortunately, it will be lost to the ether. And we, we draw thanks to the hedgehog. I'm feeling pretty good about that. We have to do it in this order, by the way. So, what do we buff now? I think our best bet is buffing... Maybe, maybe spread it between these two a little bit. And then... We roll. We got another cow. Hold up. Do we want any of this? No. We got another cow. So we send it. And then spread between the two. Then we can roll one more time. We got another kangaroo. This would be nice to level up, actually, but... I'm just going to freeze this and focus on that next turn, because right now, having more more buff scaling is important, right? So let's do it. 1816 up there at the front with melon armor. Our anti-scorpion tech. Thankfully, see, if we put the melon armor behind, the, the buses that are coming up here in a second would have pierced through and destroyed our melon armor, so... The setup is actually pretty good. And uh, we win. There's no doubt in my mind. We're running that level 2 snail. I would like to get that to level 3. And, and by the way, I've not lost... I've not lost my, my, my sight on, on the, the goal here, which is to get a level 3 tiger. I'm still, I'm still gunning for that. It's just something that I can't just will into existence, you know? We're gonna freeze this. Nothing else needs armor, so we're good. Okay. 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 Sure. Do it then. See if I care. The can's pretty good, dude. We've got some strong stuff in the shop. Did you see those 1212 bison? Just chilling in the shop? Once again, having Melon Armor second spot is actually not great because it would gotten would have gotten purged here. We we have no trouble against this squad, by the way. We're gonna we're gonna be a okay. Dude, this is a this is a kangaroo with no investment. The kangaroo is so strong. They are nerfing it next patch as well. I think they're reducing uh, both its HP and, and attack by one. It's base HP and attack, but I don't know if that's gonna be enough, honestly. Okay, Tiger. This is it. Ah, uh, but like, should we really focus on that right now? Because we've got something pretty good going on here with the with the snail. I would like to get a level a tier three snail, a level three snail. Sorry. Should we focus on that instead? I feel like we should focus on that instead. Just drop this for now, because we got a dragon right now, and uh, I feel like that might be the way forward, especially with this shop. You see in this. You see our two, our two tier ones right here. I know that I end up running, I end up running dragon a lot. I apologize, but it's it's just quite reliable scaling. I think there's a swan here. We could we could get to level three potentially, but there's a beaver here as well. So I'm gonna freeze this and roll once. See what that's looking like. Okay, we're freezing the snail. If we lose next turn, we can get a nice buff as well. 
Send it like this. I think we're looking pretty good. We're, 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 our, our, shop, our shop is buffed. Sorry. Our, shop, our shop is buffed. We got a, a level 2 kangaroo. We just got to survive long enough to get to level 3 snail. By the way, oh there there you go. There's our there's our melon armor coming into play. This person's running crabs still. I feel like it's a little too late for that. We still hit it anyway, by the way, with that melon armor. They do have a scorpion at the back, which is scaring the shit out of me. But maybe it shouldn't because we win. We're looking good, we're looking good. So I, I froze this for nothing. I'm still gonna buy it, by the way. I know that that's crazy. What am I doing? Am I about to sell that? What are you what are you what are you trying to do right there, huh? We're almost to level three snail, dude. We're almost to level three snail. Give two random friends plus one health. I think this is better than just sniping one thing for one damage. And you know what? We're actually not going to keep this. We're going to get the HP now. I, I think it does better on other units. And then we're going to roll once. And then we're going to freeze a tier one. And then we're going to go. Dragon always gets it done, dude. Dragon is too powerful. They're also introducing a new unit, by the way, called the Boar. I'm not too excited about that one. Oh, shit. This is scary. Look at this. They got the, the butterfly back there. They're introducing a new unit, which I'm not super excited about. It's the uh, the boar. By the way, we definitely lose. The boar is a tier 6, 10, 2, I think. Which, uh, what it does is, oh, we, we're going to roll hard here. We need a snail. Give us a snail. Give us a snail. Come on, man. You got to do it, right? Freeze this. Give us a snail. Oh, but we could get, we could get. We could get chocolate if we don't get the snail. Come on, dude. Give us a snail. I should be freezing any tier 1s we see, by the way. But I'm not doing it. And in the end, we didn't get any snails. So we're instead going to put a steak attack on this. But yeah, it's a, it's a, th this was a horrible turn, by the way. But whatever. We're going to hope... We're going we're gonna to roll really hard to try and get the snail next turn for sure. Because this is going to be our last one. Yeah, because we're running into teams like this. There's no way we... We, we make it past this team. Yeah, it's a 10-2. It's a 10-2, um... 10-2 tier 6. Which sounds kind of... I feel like it's a little too late, you know? I'm going hard, dude. If I lose like this, then so be it. But I'm looking for the... There it is. There it is, dude. Hold up. What gets the buff? Freeze it. Freeze it. Oh. This doesn't really matter, but we did get two, which is kind of nice, I guess. Here we go, baby. <laughs> six three, baby. Plus six, plus three. And then you're kind of useless. But I feel like we kind of have to... I feel like we've gotten on this train and we can't get off now, so... Instead, what we're going to do... Plus two, plus one. That's better than the monkey right now. Well, is it really for the front, though? Roll... This is how we lose. This is how we lose. I don't see us making it past this. It's turn 14, but we got to tier, we got to level three snails. So I'm really excited about that. Here we go. This is definitely how we lose. Look, you think our, our kangaroo is going to be able to withstand this power? Oh my God, we draw. We've been giving an, we've been given another chance at redemption. We have to, look, freeze it. We have to, to start buffing. I'm not getting rid of the snail, by the way. You cannot convince me otherwise. We might be throwing the game here, but also live a little, you know? Sometimes you just gotta live a little. And I think this is how we lose, honestly, by living a little. We got the monkey back. If we somehow survive or win this round, we'll, we'll, get a, a, we'll be really close to level three dragon as well, but... I don't, I don't think that's going to happen here. Watch this. We're going to get like a 50-50 dog at the front, followed by a bison. That's a 12-14. 12-14 turtle. Unfortunately for us... Um, yeah, we, we, we definitely lose this. Look at this. This, uh, this is a nasty, nasty, nasty... Yeah, this, the, the scorpion took us out. That was a nasty snake right there. But we got to level 3 snail. Hang on. Where is that? Where's the level 3 snail? 
There it is. We got level three snail. Okay, we um we'll do one more. We'll we'll try and speed run one more. Just because it's pretty late into the video at this point. I'm gonna fit another run in though. Here we go. Statistically best team. We're gonna be the moist sausages. I don't think there's many situations in which we actually lose this. Um unless it's I don't know how expansion pack two works out with it against this, you know? Yeah. It's the statistically strongest team, I'm pretty sure. Otter fish ant. Unfortunately, we're not doing anything for our uh, our future plays here because we, we're not running ducks. There is a duck right there. We could potentially do something like this. And then next turn, we get the level up. And you know the drill, right? You know the drill. Early tier three. But like, you know, I've been thinking early tier three. Is that really that good? Because tier three units, unless it's a dodo, tier three units are pretty dookie, right? They're pretty trash. I'm trying to think of any good tier three unit, and I'm kind of struggling. I mean, you, yeah, like you got you got turtle. Turtle kind of carries the whole show, though. Turtle and uh, and still like that. Freeze this, and the next turn, next turn we can definitely level this up again and get, have another shot. Or I guess we could save this until the next, until tier until turn five. That's quite a long way away, though. We have to win. We have to win games between here and there because we're we're gonna start losing two HP per per match at this point. We do trade nicely with the Swan, and thankfully the Mosquito hit that. Actually, that's that's the best case. But yeah, I think the ooh, hang on. Oh, we win. We win. The, that is the statistically be best team, by the way. I'm pretty sure it's Otter, Fish, and uh, dude, we're gonna do it. We're gonna hold on to this. Otter, Fish. And Ant, I think, is the, the, the best team that you can potentially get. So remember that. Tell your friends. You know a little bit of trivia. I'm not going to pill this because it's going to buff one of our ducks and I'm going to be very, very sad. I'm not going to do it for... for. Oh, man. How much are we are we willing to give away in order to make this little buff here work? Quite a, quite a bit, I guess. Come on. Give us another duck. This is crazy. I don't know what I'm doing. I've gone off the rails, dude. You could probably afford to buy a fish just for the stats. It doesn't really do anything, though. I don't know why I just did that. I, I don't know. I couldn't tell you. I couldn't tell you. We, we've gone insane. Let's go for it. it. It really... That's a horrible move, by the way. That was, like, one of the worst turns we've ever had. But right here, we get a free kill on this. And then we trade nicely with this. Unfortunately, this, uh, this peacock is going to take us to, to the next dimension. And it's going to one-shot our duck. That's good. Dude, I'm feeling great that we got level 3 snail. I'm feeling pretty fantastic. Send it. Squirrel is so bad. They're thankfully buffing it in the next patch, but... It's just so terrible. Okay, we can, we can probably send it here. Um... Isn't this the same squad we were just running, by the way? This is the exact same team we were just running. Obviously kidding. I don't think it's the exact same squad, but it's pretty darn close, isn't it? I actually don't remember. I, I had my... I, I was blinded by my, my, my rage at trying to get the snail to work. We got golden poop. Watch out. We thankfully... No, we don't take out this kangaroo. This is scary, dude. Look at this. We survive with 2 HP and then we go in and then we lose to the 7-7 seven, seven fish. I've lost. I've lost all... Oh, shit. I've lost all sorts of, 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 <laughs> of reason right now. I'm just kind of sending it. I'm going for it. What is this? This person, you can tell this is a new player, Anonymous, by the way. Usually you don't run the dog to get mid-game buffs. But, you know, you might make me eat my words because... what? Hang on. Okay, you got one more attack. You're not going to make me eat my words. Because we're about to take you out here. And then... We win. Yeah, usually when you see people buffing with... with mid, mid Buffing the dog mid-game with summons... It's a... Uh, it's a clear sign that they're kind of newer players. Which, which by the way... There's nothing wrong with that. But it's, it's you know, it's... 
You kind of have to understand how the dog works. I think the dog, the dog should be seen less as a as a summon animal, and more as a uh, when 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 a when a friend is bought. That's kind of what I see it as. I think summon is pretty crazy, actually, and the fact that it works when something is bought, but also when something is. This is really bad, by the way. It works when something is bought, but it also works when something is summoned. So it actually it's actually quite strong when you really sit down and start to think about it. Uh, by the way, we're totally fine. I don't know why I was saying that that was bad. We're chilling. We just want six wins. There's the snail. Send this. Roll once. Okay, we got skunk. Let's let's put the skunk back here. By the way, it's unfortunate. Okay, we could probably afford to do this now. There you go. It's unfortunate that the the tiger is getting removed because this is going to make skunk so bad. Once again, I go into it in my tier list, or not my tier list, in my patch notes video. But yeah, the uh, because they're removing the duck, or the duck, oh my god, what am I saying? They might as well remove the duck, honestly. They're also nerfing that to oblivion. This is really bad. Because they are uh, getting rid of the tiger, the uh, the skunk is going to be a lot worse as a result. We I think we draw, by the way. Because the skunk kind of relies on the duck. I mean, maybe it's a little too strong, but I don't know. I never thought it was like... But maybe a lot of people just don't run it. Um, so... Mm -hmm. We got to get rid of this fish at some point, right? Oh, we could totally afford to run bison, by the way. That's great. And then we got a moo cow. Moo cow. At this point, we could probably afford to send the... Oh, but then the chocolate bar goes to waste, huh? I think we should focus on buffing this before the kangaroo. We'll freeze the, uh, we'll freeze the cow. And uh, this looks good, I think. Let's put it like this. That's a 9-9 already. It's looking pretty good. Bison is really strong. Bison, I think, is pretty balanced. What is this? Here, here's one of these squads that just go, go fucking crazy. But thankfully, your kangaroo should be able to outlive this. They're running skunk too. That's that's nasty, dude. This person, this person, much respect. We we win. We totally win. By the way, they're gonna have a bee left, but we can just totally take that out with our swan. Dude, skunk in that build is crazy. Much respect, honestly. Much respect. But the swan has to go now, unfortunately, for everybody. Nobody's happy about this, but it's happening. Then, I'm actually going to buff the kangaroo, and you might be thinking, why aren't you buffing the fish? Well, we're looking to replace the fish with the, with the bison pretty shortly, just because it just does better. With that in mind, I probably should have sold the fish. We're going to do it like this, just for, so we have anti-scorpion. Uh, capabilities. I know, using can this late is a little strange. Isn't it? Isn't that strange? I don't know if it's strange. We're freezing everything. And then we're just gonna go like this. Yeah, we're running bus at the front. Or, sorry, we're running fish at the front just to avoid, avoid the, the bus purging melon armor here. And also to avoid any nasty... Any nasty incidents with... Holy shit, that giraffe is a 46-8. Can you relax? We're trying to avoid any incidents with scorpions as well. So we do unfortunately lose that. The boring balls. We have one life left. We can Or rather, we can afford to lose once. Let's think about what's important here. Before we start fucking around with all this stuff. Let's sell the fish. Buy this. We get a, a snake. I don't mind that. Um, this does buff itself. I feel like this will help it catch up quicker. This is... I didn't mean to buy it. I meant to click on this. Shit. And the next turn we can have a, two, uh, uh, a level 3 kangaroo. Man, I was hoping to run into some melon. We're in some deep shit if we run into a scorpion here. It'll not only it'll prevent our uh, 
our kangaroo from buffing up a ton as well. But here we are. Do we sur we don't survive one hit? Unfortunately. We are in some deep shit. Thankfully our snake is kind of just hitting stuff, but we definitely lose by the way. I don't know what that person was thinking that would happen in there with the rooster and the one up, but that's not how that works. That's not how that works. I know what you wanted, what you probably wanted to happen there, but that's not how that works. Anyway, that was it. That was this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate your support. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Do all that good, lovey, dubby shit because it does really help boost. Did we just gain kangaroo? Had we reached level three kangaroo before? Was that level three kangaroo? I don't remember, but we gained something in here other than the, the snail, right? I don't know. Regardless, yeah. Thank you so much for the support. Make sure to comment, do all that good shit, like the video, do... Yeah. Engage with it, and I would really appreciate that. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.